Hello, welcome to my travel channel. My name is Keenan Lambert, and in this video, I'm taking you just around the corner from Skid Row in downtown Los Angeles. If you've never heard of Skid Row, pause this video and look in the description box below if you're watching from a cell phone. If you're watching from a computer or laptop, look in the upper right hand corner of your screen. So we're going to Grand Central Market. It's one of the few remaining places that you can hang out in downtown Los Angeles. Los Angeles often gets a lot of criticism for not having a lot of culture. Let this video be a little bit of a pushback against that notion. Grand Central Market is cool because the food is sort of a representation of the different ethnic groups that make up Los Angeles. Again, just so you understand where we're at spatially, we're just around the corner from this place. This place smells amazing. It reminds me of Thanksgiving morning when you wake up and mom's already started cooking the turkey. For those of you who are already subscribed, you know normally I'd eat the food, but in this video I had a little bit of a stomach issue. I don't mean to give them free advertisement, but if it wasn't for Imodium, this video wouldn't be possible. As of right now, indoor dining is on hold. People are expected to retrieve their food and eat outdoors, socially distanced. Smash the like button if my voice is unnecessarily deep. If you've never heard of Jaritos, it's one of the most popular Mexican soft drinks. And they're using it to line the walls in this installation. Based on the amount of people waiting, you know this is the spot with the good food. I think this is Salvadorian food. If you know, let me know in the comments below.
As you can see, there's no shortage of Mexican food here. Now the next thing we're going to walk past should be illegal. Glazed donuts stuffed with sweetened strawberries. Food porn. Yeah, that's legal. With being so close to Mexico, where all these fruits are grown, I expected to find some rare exotic fruits, but everything looked pretty standard to me. The next time you go to an authentic Mexican restaurant, ask for agua de tamarindo. It's a refreshing, sweet, sour drink. I want to shift gears here. Let's have a conversation about Skid Row. Just two blocks to our left, you have people living under tents and tarps. Meanwhile, billion dollar corporations continue to thrive blocks away. There must be a happy medium. Homelessness has gotten so out of hand that the camps have spread to parks all around Los Angeles, including Venice Beach. For many, open fire hydrants and public toilets are the only access to fresh water. This is unacceptable. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. I want to hear from you and I will respond back. Thank you so much for watching. How about you smash the subscribe button and travel with me for free. Wait.